Nelson, and I'm here today to talk to you about NAICS codes. NAICS is an acronym for the North American Industry Classification System. This is a classification of business establishments by type of economic activity. Since 1997, it has largely replaced the SIX system that was previously in place other than for some governmental agencies. NAICS codes must be reported on your business tax returns as well as on Schedule C's for any sole proprietors or single member LLCs. Your NAICS code is typically not assigned to you, however, you must choose one based on your primary business activity. NAICS codes all start with a two-digit main category. For example, codes starting in the numbers 2-3 are related to construction. Codes starting in the numbers 7-2 are for accommodation and food services. One exception to the NAICS codes being assigned is that the U.S. Census Bureau may assign NAICS codes based on your primary business activity. If you receive any documentation from an agency other than the U.S. Census Bureau, you should contact that agency directly to determine how they came up with your code and if the code is accurate, and if not, you will need to change it. Once you determine your main category, you then look at subcategories to obtain the additional four digits of your six-digit NAICS code. It is very important that your NAICS code is correct as these codes are often used as a basis for lending and government funding programs. For example, in this second PPP draw, if you're a business with an NAICS code that starts with 7-2, your loan is based on 3.5% of payroll, not 2.5%. So right now, it's very important to make sure that your code is accurate. If you review your tax return and you determine that your NAICS code as reported on the return is not accurate, you will need to amend a prior return or make sure that it is correct on your 2020 tax return. If you're unsure if your code is correct or if you need to make an adjustment, please contact us and continue to look for further information. Thank you.